In September 2012, 2011, Al Mayo began his training at the Connecticut Fire Academy, sponsored by the City of New London's Fire Department. Mr. Mayo was pulled from the Academy <clears throat> by the City of New London three days prior to his graduation. The reason New London gave for his dismissal was that his grades were substandard. He was accused of writing words class of 48 in a fresh bed of cement, and as you will see in the report, and if you don't have a copy of the report, there's a copy over here, and we found out that his grades were actually 90% average. He was not the recruit that wrote in the cement. In fact, there was two incidents regarding cement. A white recruit finally admitted to writing in the cement. That recruit graduated and went on to become a firefighter in the state of Connecticut. Meanwhile, coordinator D, D. Ford reported to the New London's fire chief the high probability that recruit Mayo was responsible and based on that belief and that although the defacing itself was not viewed as significant, there was no conclusive evidence as to who was responsible for the second incident. Some of the recruits jokingly and suggested that the black guy did it. <clears throat> really, it's just not about Mayo. Mayo is my kid. Mayo is your kid. I have a 21-year-old right now that wants to be a state police officer, and he's in the process of taking the test. What about him going into that classroom and have to deal with this same bull that this guy had to deal with? I don't want that. They're wrong. We've put a hole in everything they have said. Now it's time to, uh, to say to, to Mr. Mayo, we were wrong and get a man his job back.